We're having a barbecue is what we're doing. And what we're gonna do is, the goal is not to use any bad chemicals or anything that is poisonous. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use a paper towel soaked in olive oil. And we're gonna use some real wood lump charcoal, the Zero, all natural hardwood charcoal that came from Brazil. And we're gonna light it with the method that a Brazilian taught me. That makes more sense to me than lighter fluid and anything else. So we're gonna take olive oil. We don't need the most expensive olive oil to do this method. We're just gonna soak this towel in olive oil. And this is gonna be our catalyst to get our fire rolling. Get this bad boy soaked. It takes a little more olive oil than you think. I'm not afraid of getting this oil on my hands as I get automotive dirt and oil on my hands all day long, every day. Probably actually good for my hands. I'm gonna take the paper towel, lay it flat where you wanna have your fire. I will stress one paper towel is all you need. You might think you wanna put two or more in there, but you will have a nice Roman candle going. I'm gonna take some of the stuff that I pulled out of the grill that we had already burned. I'm gonna lay it on that paper towel. You don't really uh, need to use charcoal that, that's been previously burnt. Um, I'm using it because I have it and there's no sense in wasting it, it's not bad. So we just create a nice little pile, leaving the four corners of the towel exposed because that's where you're going to light the, the towel from. And what we're gonna do Take a little bit of the olive oil. I'm gonna drizzle it all over the wood. What that's gonna do is soak into the hard wood. Paper towels prevent it from going into wasting into the bottom of the stove. This method here really impressed me because basically in a nutshell, we're burning olive oil, which Romans and ancient time people did in their lamps and um, it adds a really nice flavor to your food, believe it or not. Where a lighter fluid adds a nasty naphtha, petroleum-based taste. So, use a propane torch or use a lighter. Propane torch is a little easier to start the fire, only based in where you're at. You can just light up your corners, or you could use one of those long-reach lighters. I personally don't own one. I have a torch and I have a Zippo. and then you just let the four corners burn into the wood, leaving the lid open. That is a key element. Don't close the lid while the paper towel is trying to get your wood lit on fire because it doesn't seem to work as well. I learned this from my uh, Brazilian neighbor down at my garage who taught me this method and he cooked for me while we were doing a project here at this house. And I was so impressed with his cooking that I had to build a grill and learn his method of cooking because I've never had barbecue taste so good. You can see how it's burning in there. We can close this grate. Let the grate start to warm up. A little bit slower. Not like a propane grill, but the benefits sure uh, outweigh the propane or the Kingsford. Plus the smell is intoxicating. So basically we're waiting for the, all this to get real nice cherry and glowing and some flames cooking. Oh, we got the smoke cooking, baby. We have a fire. So as of right now, as you can tell, we have a nice good ember base going and we have a good wood burning fire that's safe for cooking over without any lighter fluid of any kind used to light the fire. Just good clean olive oil and a paper towel which is probably all gone now um, and real Brazilian hardwood charcoal. It could be used with any charcoal of course but I was taught with the Brazilian charcoal and I bought the Brazilian charcoal because that's what they use and I'm going to follow suit because it tastes so damn good. 
Also, let me know in the comments section if uh, this helped you improve your barbecue, because I know this, it increased my barbecue game from, from nothing to wanting to barbecue like a madman. And as you can see, our fire is really starting to rip roar now, getting ready to uh, close that lid on this grill, let this baby heat up our grill, we'll spread our embers around, throw some fresh charcoal on, and we'll be in good shape. We're gonna let the temperature rise. One paper towel. That's all it takes, one paper towel. So we're gonna close it up, let it get some heat in there. And if you uh, like this grill, we have a little treat for you. I happened to film the entire process of the uh, manufacture of this homemade grill for uh, your viewing pleasure. All right, let's get the food. Yeah. And that right there is your Brazilian barbecue fire starting method with the use of olive oil and a paper towel and real Brazilian hardwood charcoal, not using charcoal briquettes.